1940 Wheat Lincoln Penny. Known for its rarity and incredible value, this coin has captured the attention of collectors worldwide. Join me as we explore what makes this penny so special and why it's worth a million dollars, imagine stumbling upon a small, seemingly ordinary penny from 1940. At first glance, it appears like any other coin, but little do you know, it holds a secret that could change your life. This particular penny is not just a piece of currency, it's a piece of history, a relic that tells a story of its own, the 1940 wheat Lincoln penny was minted during a pivotal time in American history. As the United States recovered from the Great Depression and prepared for the challenges of World War II, these pennies were struck with the iconic wheat ears reverse design, symbolizing prosperity and growth. What sets the 1940 wheat penny apart from others is its rarity. Due to various factors such as limited minting numbers, errors during production, or unique variations in the coin's design, certain specimens of this penny have become incredibly scarce. Among them, the ones in pristine condition can fetch astounding prices at auctions and among private collectors, now, let's talk numbers. While not every 1940 wheat Lincoln penny reaches the million-dollar mark, certain rare variations, especially those in impeccable condition and with specific mint marks, have been known to command such astronomical prices in the numismatic market, for instance, in recent auctions, a 1940 wheat penny with a rare minting error or a flawless uncirculated specimen has been sold for substantial sums. These auctions not only highlight the coin's monetary value but also underscore its importance as a historical artifact cherished by collectors worldwide. That I in conclusion, the 1940 wheat Lincoln penny is more than just a coin, it's a piece of American heritage, a symbol of resilience and rarity. Whether you're a seasoned collector or someone new to the world of numismatics, this coin serves as a reminder of the treasures that can be found in the most unexpected places. 1941 Wheat Lincoln Penny Did you know that among the countless coins minted over the years, some hold incredible value? One such coin is the 1941 Wheat Lincoln Penny. The 1941 Wheat Penny, struck during a pivotal time in American history, holds more than just numismatic value. Minted as the United States geared up for World War II, these coins represent a snapshot of a nation on the brink of global conflict. What makes the 1941 wheat penny so special? It features Abraham Lincoln on the obverse and the iconic wheat ears on the reverse, a design cherished by collectors for its simplicity and beauty. While most 1941 wheat pennies were minted in large numbers, there are rare varieties, such as those with mint marks, that can significantly increase their value. Collectors often seek out coins minted in San Francisco, S, Denver, D, or Philadelphia, no mint mark. In recent years, the value of the 1941 wheat penny has soared, with some rare specimens fetching upwards of a million dollars at auction. Factors like condition, rarity, and demand all play a role in determining its market price. If you're lucky enough to come across a 1941 wheat penny in your collection or inheritance, remember to handle it with care. Store it in a protective case to preserve its condition and potential value. The 1941 wheat Lincoln penny is not just a piece of history, it's a valuable artifact that connects us to a bygone era. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, exploring the stories behind these coins can be a rewarding journey. 1942 Wheat Lincoln Penny You might be surprised to learn that this seemingly ordinary coin could be worth up to a million dollars. Yes, you heard that right. Let's explore why. The 1942 Wheat Lincoln Penny holds a special place in numismatic history. Produced during a critical period in American history, these coins were minted in large numbers due to wartime demands for copper. However, a small number were mistakenly struck in bronze, a metal reserved for pennies prior to the war. Now, here's the kicker, those rare 1942 Lincoln pennies struck in bronze instead of zinc-coated steel are incredibly scarce. The unique composition makes them stand out from the regular pennies of that year. Their rarity, combined with the historical context, contributes to their staggering value on the collector's market. Recent auctions and sales have shown that a well-preserved 1942 bronze Lincoln penny can fetch anywhere from hundreds of thousands to over a million dollars at auction. 
the demand among collectors for these rare gems continues to drive their value sky high. Identifying a 1942 bronze Lincoln penny is crucial if you're ever lucky enough to come across one. Look for a distinct reddish-brown color that sets it apart from the usual silver-colored 1942 pennies. The weight and magnetic properties also differ from the more common steel pennies of the era. If you're into coin collecting or thinking of starting, keep an eye out for overlooked treasures like the 1942 bronze Lincoln penny. It could be hiding in plain sight, waiting to be discovered in your pocket change, a collection inherited from a relative, or even at a local coin show. And there you have it, the story of the 1942 wheat Lincoln penny, a coin worth millions due to its rarity and historical significance. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just curious about valuable coins, this penny proves that hidden treasures can turn up in the most unexpected places. Numismatics, the legendary 1943 wheat Lincoln penny that could be worth millions. During World War II, the United States was in desperate need of copper for the war effort. To conserve this essential metal, the U.S. Mint made a significant change. In 1943, they decided to produce pennies using zinc-coated steel instead of the usual copper. Most of these 1943 pennies were made from steel, giving them a unique silver color. However, a few were mistakenly struck in copper, using leftover bronze planchets from 1942. The 1943 copper penny is the holy grail for collectors. These coins are so rare that when one comes up for auction, it generates a lot of excitement. Depending on its condition and provenance, a 1943 copper penny can fetch upwards of a million dollars. In recent years, these elusive pennies have set records at auctions. For instance, one sold for $1.7 million in 2010. If you're lucky enough to come across a 1943 penny, here's how you can tell if it's one of the rare copper versions, a copper penny weighs about 3.11 grams, while a steel penny weighs 2.7 grams. Copper pennies are not magnetic, but steel ones are. Copper pennies have a distinctive reddish-brown color compared to the silver color of steel pennies. Remember, if you think you found a 1943 copper penny, it's crucial to have it authenticated by a professional grading service. Professional authentication can verify the coin's legitimacy and significantly increase its value. Services like PCGS and NGC are well-respected in the numismatic community. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting, the story of the 1943 copper penny is a reminder of the treasures that might be hiding in your pocket change. We're talking about an incredibly rare and highly sought-after coin, the 1944 wheat Lincoln penny, which can be worth up to a million dollars. Yes, you heard that right. This tiny coin could make you a millionaire. So, what makes the 1944 Wheat Lincoln Penny so special? Let's find out. First, a little history. The 1944 Wheat Penny was struck during World War II, a time when the United States was conserving copper for the war effort. As a result, pennies from 1943 were made of steel. But in 1944, the Mint returned to using copper, although some 1943 steel planchets accidentally got mixed in, resulting in the rare 1944 steel scent. Most 1944 pennies were made from copper, like this one. But a few were mistakenly struck on leftover steel planchets from 1943. These steel pennies are the ones that can be worth a fortune. The key to identifying a rare 1944 steel penny is simple, use a magnet. Copper pennies won't stick, but steel ones will. Also, Steel pennies have a distinct silvery appearance, unlike the reddish hue of copper pennies. Here's how you do it. Take a magnet and see if your 1944 penny sticks. If it does, you might just have a million dollar coin in your hand. To confirm the authenticity and value of your 1944 steel penny, it's best to get it graded by a professional service like PCGS or NGC. These experts can verify if your coin is genuine and assign it a grade based on its condition, which significantly impacts its value. Most 1944 pennies are copper, but a few rare steel ones exist. Use a magnet to check if your 1944 penny is steel. 
Have your coin authenticated and graded by professionals. If you're lucky enough to have a genuine 1944 steel penny in excellent condition, you could be looking at a value of up to a million dollars. 1945 Wheat Lincoln Penny Known for its historical significance and rarity, this coin has captured the attention of collectors worldwide, with some even fetching up to a million dollars. Stick around as we uncover the secrets behind this iconic piece of numismatic history. The year 1945 marked the end of World War II and a pivotal moment in American history. Amidst these historic events, the U.S. Mint produced a limited number of Lincoln pennies, each bearing the iconic wheat design on the reverse. Only a select few 1945 Lincoln pennies were minted due to wartime shortages of copper, making them exceptionally rare today. What sets the 1945 edition apart is its scarcity and the high demand among collectors. Some pristine specimens have been auctioned for staggering sums, reaching into the millions, asterisk during 1945, as the world celebrated the end of a global conflict, the U.S. Mint continued its tradition of minting Lincoln pennies. However, production challenges meant that only a fraction of these coins were ever circulated. The 1945 wheat penny is a prized possession among collectors. Its scarcity, coupled with the historical significance of the year, makes it a true gem in any collection. Variations in condition and mint marks significantly impact the value of each coin. While some may bear the D mint mark from Denver or S from San Francisco, others are more pristine than their counterparts. Recent auctions have seen these coins fetching astonishing prices at auction houses and online platforms. The highest quality specimens with minimal wear and unique characteristics command the highest bids, often exceeding expectations. As we wrap up our journey into the world of numismatics, remember that every coin tells a story. The 1945 Wheat Lincoln Penny not only represents a pivotal year in American history but also stands as a testament to the artistry and craftsmanship of the U.S. Mint. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, keep an eye out for these rare treasures, they might just be hiding in your pocket change. 1946 Wheat Lincoln Penny This little coin holds a big surprise, it's potentially worth millions of dollars. Stick around as we uncover the story and value behind this numismatic treasure, imagine stumbling across an old jar of coins in your attic and finding a 1946 wheat Lincoln penny. What would you do? Most people might not think much of it, but this particular coin is not your average penny. The 1946 wheat penny was minted in Philadelphia, Denver, and San Francisco. Each mint produced different quantities, affecting rarity what makes the 1946 wheat penny so valuable. It's all about scarcity. Due to low mintage numbers and some minting errors, certain versions of this penny are incredibly rare, now, let's talk numbers. While most 1946 wheat pennies are worth a few cents to a few dollars, there are some exceptional specimens that collectors would pay a fortune to own. Pennies from the Denver Mint tend to be more valuable due to lower production numbers. San Francisco Mint pennies are also sought after, especially in pristine condition. Coins with errors like double strikes or off-center strikes can fetch premiums at auctions. I in recent auctions, a well-preserved 1946 D wheat penny sold for over $100,000 due to its rarity and condition. Meet collectors who specialize in Lincoln wheat pennies, explaining why these coins are more than just currency, they're pieces of history. The 1946 wheat Lincoln penny is a prime example of how something small can hold immense value. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just curious about coins, this penny reminds us that treasures can be found in the most unexpected places. Who knows? Your next lucky find might just be a million-dollar penny. 1947 Wheat Lincoln Penny Known for its scarcity and incredible value, this coin has captured the attention of collectors worldwide. Join me as we uncover the secrets behind this remarkable piece of numismatic history. Briefly introduce the significance of the Wheat Penny series minted from 1909 to 1958. Discuss the historical context of 1947, highlighting key events that shaped the year. Explain why the 1947 Wheat Penny is considered rare. Detail factors such as mintage numbers, condition rarity, and collector demand that contribute to its high value. 
mention recent auction prices or sales that demonstrate its worth, emphasizing its million-dollar valuation. Describe the design features of the 1947 Wheat Penny, focusing on its obverse, front, and reverse, back. Highlight any notable variants or errors known to exist within this specific year, which could further increase its value. Discuss the importance of preservation and proper handling for maintaining the coin's value. Explain how grading agencies evaluate coins like the 1947 Wheat Penny, including criteria such as wear, luster, and overall condition. Offer advice to aspiring collectors on how to identify a genuine 1947 Wheat Penny. Share insights into current market trends and where collectors might find such rare coins, including auctions, numismatic shows, and reputable dealers. Share anecdotes or stories of significant sales or discoveries related to the 1947 Wheat Penny. Highlight any famous collections or auctions where this coin made headlines, asterisk asterisk, as we conclude our journey into the world of numismatics, the 1947 Wheat Lincoln Penny stands out not only for its rarity but also for its historical significance and value. Whether you're a seasoned collector or a newcomer to the hobby, this coin serves as a reminder of the hidden treasures waiting to be discovered in every collection. Thank you for joining me today. And don't forget to subscribe for more insights into the world of rare coins. Until next time, happy collecting. We're talking about a coin that has sparked a lot of interest, the 1948 Wheat Lincoln Penny. The 1948 Wheat Penny, also known as the Lincoln Cent, features the iconic portrait of President Abraham Lincoln on the obverse, designed by Victor D. Brenner. The reverse showcases two wheat stalks, a design that was used from 1909 to 1958. Now, you might be wondering, what makes this particular coin so valuable? Well, let's explore a few key factors that could contribute to its high value. First, condition is everything in the world of coin collecting. Coins in pristine condition, known as mint state, can fetch a premium. A 1948 wheat penny in mint state could be worth hundreds or even thousands of dollars. But what about those rare instances where a coin sells for a million dollars? These extraordinary prices are usually due to a combination of rarity, historical significance, and collector demand. The 1948 wheat penny isn't particularly rare in general, but there are certain varieties and errors that can make it more valuable. Error coins, such as those with double dies or off-center strikes, can be highly sought after by collectors. Coins with a known history or those that were part of significant collections can also command higher prices. There have been instances where unique coins, due to their rarity or errors, have sold for staggering amounts. While a standard 1948 wheat penny is unlikely to reach a million dollars, finding a rare variant or an error coin could still be a significant payday. So, the next time you come across a 1948 wheat penny, take a closer look. You never know, you might just have a hidden treasure in your hands. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more coin collecting tips and fascinating stories. 1949 Lincoln Wheat Penny Could one of these be worth a million dollars? Let's find out, this is a 1949 Lincoln Wheat Penny. At first glance, it might look like any other penny from the era, but there's more to this coin than meets the eye. Today, we're going to explore what makes some 1949 pennies incredibly valuable and what you should look for if you want to strike gold in your coin collection. First, a bit of history. The Lincoln Wheat Penny was minted from 1909 to 1958. The 1949 pennies are not particularly rare, with over 200 million minted. However, specific characteristics can make a penny from this year worth a small fortune. Check for the mint mark. The 1949 pennies were minted in Philadelphia, No Mint Mark, Denver, D, and San Francisco, S. While none of these are extremely rare, the condition and unique errors can significantly affect the value. The condition of the coin, known as the grade, is crucial. A penny in mint state, MS, condition, especially MS 65 or higher, can fetch thousands of dollars. Look for a penny with sharp details and minimal wear. This is where things get interesting. 
Some 1949 pennies have unique errors or varieties, like double die errors, repunched mint marks, or off-center strikes. These errors are highly sought after by collectors, this occurs when the coin is struck more than once, causing a noticeable doubling of letters or numbers on the coin. A 1949 penny with a double die error can be incredibly valuable, sometimes, the mint mark is punched more than once, leading to a shadow or doubling effect. A 1949 penny with a repunched mint mark can be a rare find. When the coin is not properly aligned during minting, it can be struck off-center. This type of error is visually striking and can significantly increase the coin's value. Now, let's talk about how you can find out if your 1949 penny is one of these rare gems. Here are some steps you can follow, use a magnifying glass or a jeweler's loop to closely inspect your penny. Look for any signs of doubling, mint mark anomalies, or off-center strikes. If you're unsure about the grade, consider getting your coin professionally graded by a reputable service like PCGS or NGC. This can help verify its condition and authenticity. Check auction sites, coin forums, and price guides to see if similar coins have sold and for how much. This will give you an idea of your coin's potential value, remember, even if your 1949 penny isn't worth a million dollars, it could still be a valuable piece of history. Coin collecting is a fascinating hobby that connects us to the past and can be incredibly rewarding. Story for you, one that involves a humble penny worth a jaw-dropping million dollars. Yes, you heard that right. We're talking about the legendary 1950-week Lincoln penny. So, let's get into it. Before we get to the exciting part about its value, let's take a quick look at the history of the wheat Lincoln penny. First minted in 1909 to honor the centennial of Abraham Lincoln's birth, these pennies were in circulation until 1958. The obverse features Lincoln's profile, designed by Victor D. Brenner, while the reverse showcases two wheat ears, hence the name, wheat penny. Now, what makes the 1950 wheat Lincoln penny so special? Most 1950 pennies aren't particularly rare or valuable. However, there are always exceptions to the rule. In this case, a unique error or a rare minting variation can skyrocket its value. Imagine finding one of these pennies in your pocket change or coin collection. One of the most intriguing aspects of coin collecting is the hunt for those rare errors or varieties that can turn an ordinary coin into an extraordinary treasure. Error coins occur when something goes wrong during the minting process. This could be a double die, off-center strike, or an unusual metal composition. These mistakes make the coin unique and, in some cases, extremely valuable. The million-dollar story of the 1950 wheat penny centers around a few key factors. One particular penny was discovered with a major error that made it one of a kind. Collectors and numismatists couldn't believe their eyes when they saw this penny. The unique characteristics, combined with its excellent condition, resulted in an astronomical auction price. Dramatically, imagine the excitement at the auction house when the final bid reached a staggering $1 million. It's moments like these that fuel the passion of coin collectors around the world. So, what should you look for in a 1950 wheat penny? Keep an eye out for any unusual markings double strikes, or other anomalies. Even a slight variation can make a huge difference in value. And there you have it, folks. The incredible story of the 1950 wheat Lincoln penny worth a million dollars. Remember, coin collecting is not just a hobby, it's a thrilling treasure hunt. Who knows? You might have a rare gem hiding in your collection right now. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more amazing coin stories. Thanks for watching, and happy collecting! We have an incredible story for you about a 1951 Wheat Lincoln penny that's worth a jaw dropping million dollars. Yes, you heard that right, a million dollar penny. So, what makes this particular penny so special? Let's take a closer look. The 1951 Wheat Lincoln penny was minted during an era when the United States was recovering from World War II and heading into a period of economic growth. The Wheat Penny, designed by Victor David Brenner, features the iconic image of Abraham Lincoln on the obverse and two wheat stalks on the reverse. 
While millions of these pennies were minted between 1909 and 1958, only a handful have become extremely valuable due to unique errors, high-grade conditions, or special mint marks. This particular 1951 penny is special for a few reasons. First, it's a proof coin, meaning it was struck using specially prepared dies and planchets to create a highly detailed and mirror-like finish. Proof coins are typically made in limited quantities and are highly sought after by collectors. Asterisk, but what sets this penny apart is its remarkable condition. It's graded as a PR-70 by the Professional Coin Grading Service, PCGS, which is the highest grade possible. This means the coin is in perfect condition, with no visible flaws under 5x magnification. So, how did this penny reach the million-dollar mark? Well, its combination of rarity, perfect condition, and historical significance makes it a true gem in the numismatic world. Collectors and investors are willing to pay top dollar for such a pristine example of an already rare coin. In recent years, we've seen rare coins fetching astronomical prices at auctions. The 1951 Wheat Lincoln Penny in PR-70 condition is no exception. In fact, it was sold at a major auction for just over $1 million, making it one of the most valuable pennies ever. And there you have it, the fascinating story of the million-dollar 1951 Wheat Lincoln Penny. It's amazing to think that a humble penny could be worth so much, but that's the magic of numismatics. Now, let's get into why a 1952 Wheat Lincoln Penny could be worth up to a million dollars. The Wheat Lincoln Penny, also known as the Wheat Cent, was minted from 1909 to 1958. The 1952 edition is part of this iconic series, featuring the profile of Abraham Lincoln on the obverse and two wheat stalks on the reverse. But what makes the 1952 penny so special? The value of any coin is determined by several factors, rarity, condition, and demand. While millions of 1952 pennies were minted, certain variations and minting errors make some of them exceptionally rare and valuable. One of the key factors that can skyrocket the value of a 1952 penny is minting errors. For example, a double die error, where the coin design is accidentally stamped twice, can make a coin extremely valuable. Another example is the off-center strike, where the coin's design is not perfectly centered. Condition is crucial in determining a coin's value. Coins are graded on a scale from poor, P1, to mint state, MS, 70. A 1952 penny in mint state, with its original luster and no signs of wear, can fetch a significantly higher price than one in circulated condition. In recent years, we've seen 1952 wheat pennies with rare errors or in pristine condition sell for staggering amounts at auctions. Some have even reached the million-dollar mark. These sales highlight the importance of closely examining your coins and understanding their potential value. If you think you might have a valuable 1952 wheat penny, here's how you can check its worth. Use a magnifying glass to inspect the coin for any errors or unusual features. Check the condition and consider getting it professionally graded by a reputable service like PCGS or NGC. So, there you have it. The 1952 Wheat Lincoln Penny is a perfect example of how a small piece of history can hold immense value. Remember to keep an eye on your pocket change and you might just find a hidden treasure. 1953 Wheat Lincoln Penny and whether it can actually fetch a whopping million dollars at auction. First, let's talk about the basics. The Wheat Lincoln Penny was minted from 1909 to 1958, with the Wheat Ears design on the reverse side. The 1953 Wheat Penny was produced in three different mints, Philadelphia, No Mint Mark, Denver, D, and San Francisco, S. But what makes a 1953 Wheat Penny worth a million dollars? The key lies in its rarity, condition, and any unique characteristics it might have. Condition is crucial. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70, with 70 being a perfect coin. For a 1953 wheat penny to reach a high value, it would need to be in nearly perfect condition, often referred to as mint state. Now, let's talk about errors. Coins with minting errors can be extremely valuable. For example, 
a double die error, where the design appears to be doubled, can significantly increase a coin's value. Another factor is provenance. If a coin has an interesting history or was part of a famous collection, it can boost its value. But realistically, can a 1953 wheat penny be worth a million dollars? While it's unlikely, it's not impossible. Rare mint errors, impeccable condition, and a unique history can push a coin's value into the stratosphere. However, most 1953 wheat pennies are valued between a few cents to a few dollars. If you think you might have a valuable 1953 wheat penny, the best step is to get it professionally graded. This will give you an accurate idea of its condition and value. So, while the dream of a million-dollar penny is exciting, it's essential to approach with realistic expectations. But who knows? Maybe you could be the lucky one to find that hidden treasure. Coin that has sparked the imagination of collectors everywhere, the 1954 Wheat Lincoln Penny. Could this humble penny really be worth a million dollars? Let's find out. The Lincoln Wheat Penny, designed by Victor David Brenner, has been a staple in American coinage since its introduction in 1909. However, the 1954 Wheat Lincoln Penny has garnered significant attention. But what makes it so special? First, let's talk about the basics. The 1954 Wheat Penny was minted in three locations, Philadelphia, No Mint Mark, Denver, D Mint Mark, and San Francisco, S Mint Mark. Most of these pennies are common and worth only a few cents. However, certain conditions and errors can make these coins extremely valuable. One of the key factors that can increase a coin's value is its condition. Coins graded as Mint State MS by professional grading services can fetch significantly higher prices. For instance, a 1954 penny graded MS67 can be worth hundreds of dollars. But what about a million-dollar penny? For a 1954 Wheat Lincoln penny to reach such an astronomical value, it would likely need to be a unique error coin or have an extraordinary story behind it. Error coins, like double dies or off-center strikes, are highly sought after by collectors. If a 1954 Wheat penny with a significant error were to surface, it could drive the price up considerably. Additionally, coins with an exceptional provenance, like being part of a famous collection or having a notable history, can also command higher prices. Another factor that could contribute to a million-dollar valuation is market demand. If a wealthy collector or institution has a specific interest in acquiring a rare 1954 wheat penny, the bidding war could drive the price sky high. In recent years, we've seen incredible prices for rare coins. In 2010, a 1943 copper penny sold for over a million dollars. While there's no known 1954 wheat penny that has reached this level yet, it's not entirely out of the realm of possibility. So, while the average 1954 wheat Lincoln penny in your pocket might not be worth much more than face value, the right combination of rarity, condition, and demand could make it worth a fortune. Always check your change and keep an eye out for those hidden treasures. Asterisk, if you think you have a valuable coin, consider getting it professionally graded and appraised. It could be worth more than you think.